So Daniel, as we are approaching 2024, in terms of job search strategies, in terms of anything related to the job career or job journey, what are you seeing that job seekers or students should be aware of? Yeah, I think, you know, you see the abundance of new AI tools that are coming out to help you with the job search. And I guess my advice would be is that that can be really good, but that can be really bad. Mm -hmm. uh, you need to understand this. And whether it's 2024, 2025, 2050, at the end of the day, you know, companies, every time they're hiring, they're making an investment, yes. right? So if they're hiring you, they can't invest that money into a new equipment, a new office, a new marketing idea or nothing. And so you have to remember that every time they make an investment, they're looking at two factors, risk versus reward. Mm -hmm. And that is why when you do a quality application, it's better and you have a better chance of getting a job than if you do quantity applications. You're better off applying 10 quality applications a week than applying to 100. And what I've seen is that people have always done the shotgun approach, apply, apply in masses. Yeah. And these AI tools are making it easier for you to apply to even more companies. And that seems like it's helpful, but it's not, it's about quality. Now, on the flip side, you can use AI to help you do a quality applications in a much faster way. I think you should still customize your resume. You should still sure. customize your, you should create cover letters. And AI tools can help you do that. Teal, Hunter, uh, Career Flow, uh, there's tons of them out there. Chat GPT yeah. that you can use for the for your job search. So with that being said, yes, AI can be a help, but don't let it replace you and don't forget yes. quality over quantity. Yeah, that's very important. You know, customize your resume, your cover letters when applying. And again, as you mentioned with Chat GPT, a lot of uh, even career coaches I have seen how to use it. It's a, a kind, of, kind of a first draft. Don't copy paste all. Put your personality, but it will help you uh, apply more uh, customers and more quality applications. A thousand percent. And with that, Daniel, my interview comes to an end. I really enjoyed the conversation. Very practical tips. Thank you very much. And for the audience, as I mentioned earlier, this is my last interview for 2023. So I wish you all the best. You can check all the videos from last year and you can check them, uh, uh, the link is below. Again, I wish you all Happy New Year and Merry Christmas. And Daniel, thank you very much. And let's keep in touch and see you soon. Bye everyone. Thank you.